Would you introduce yourself, please? Hi, I'm Matt the Dodson. I'm Stephanie Dodson's son. And tell us how old you are. I'm 19, and I go to Ball State University. I'm a freshman. Okay, so what are you going to be doing right now? Well, I'm doing some sort of worksheet, it seems like. It's going to help us with our math spiral review for the week. So <laughs> what's the first thing we need to do, Adler? Um, we need to put our name at the top our and, our, and, our um, number. and our number, of course. So, so Adler, go ahead and write your name. I'm Adler Dotson, number one. <laughs> okay. All right, and then, okay. Uh, Go ahead and read them and then tell, kind of tell the this students how you do it. blank plus one equals ten. Oh, so I'm just right doing, filling this out. Okay. Yeah. So this is addition over here. So you got to do subtraction over here with this. Okay. So you got to take one away from ten. And then it gets you nine. And then you put nine over here because nine plus one equals ten. Good. There we go. Okay. Right. Now, does 10 minus 1 equal 9 as well? Yes, that so also. those equations are equal, right? Yes, yeah. 10 minus 1 equals 9 as well, so they Okay, equal and then we're going to gonna put it over on that line just so it's easy for our teacher nine. to grade it. Okay, booyah. Then we put the 9. Oh, is this a test? No. This, we just do it together, then Friday they do it on their own. Okay, so for number two, determine if the equation shown is true or false. What does false mean again? False means it's not true. Okay. What do you mean? <laughs> okay. So. So, yeah, like. Is nine, nine equals five in what universe? None. You know what I mean? Nine doesn't equal five. Five equals five. Five doesn't equal nine. It's just not. It's so, what not we accurate. Put on the line? so, we probably put a no, right? Or well, false? Yes, false. So, so I'm going to circle that. And then write on the line. And, and put big F for false. And then I'm doing. How many? Am I doing all these? Just do Mondays, and then we'll stop and do Tuesdays. Okay. Um, number three, while exercising, Victor did seven push-ups in the morning and two more in the afternoon. How many push-ups did Victor do total? <laughs> okay, we got to add these up then. So um, you do the first day, add it to the second day. So the Victor did seven push-ups oh no, in the morning. Okay, so seven. And he did two more in the afternoon. So I'm adding those because he did more. And then how many push-ups did he do total? So equals. That's nine. Booyah. Okay. Quick math. Nine for number three. And number four. So Caleb had $13. He spent eight on a new video game. How much does he have now? Okay, so he has 13. He spends it. So he's losing it. Not a good play. So you do 13 minus eight. And then you put an equal sign. 13 minus 8 is what, Mrs. Dodson? 5. 5? Is that your final answer? Yes. Okay, 5. I counted up from 8 to get 5. Okay, counted up from 8 yep, to get 5. That equals 13. So the answer is 5. Boom. Okay. Okay. Count the number of objects. So I'm just counting these things? Yeah, but I teach them to, like, mark it out as you're counting it so you don't yeah, lose track. Yeah, that's what I do, too. Perfect. All right, 1, 2... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Should never get these wrong, people. Okay, so right there. <laughs> All okay, right, thanks, Adler. Monday's done.